Hello, everybody. Welcome to Thursday. Hello, Brad. Hello, Alex. Making Thank my you. Thursday face. Oh, that's here. your Thursday face? That's my Thursday face. Thursday doesn't start until you welcome me to it, Vinny. Okay. So thank you. Welcome to Thursday. Hey, we can call this First Friday. Maybe we, First mm. Friday, and we'll have a second Friday tomorrow. For oh, pre-Friday? Yeah, it's our first Friday here. Um, hi, everybody. Hopefully you can hear and see us. We're going to get right into it because I've got a hard out. I have My daughter's got a concert, a winter concert I need to go to Ooh. at uh, around 530. So we're going to try and wrap is, things up before that. Is there a guitar? No, she's singing. This is like the singing mm. concert uh, this time. She did play uh, the family band. I'm going to get right to it after I talk about my family. Thank you. Uh, did play out with Max on the drums and my daughter on the guitar. Uh, and, yeah. a, and a bassist who uh, is a professional bassist who is, is older now, but was in a, I'm not going to name the band because I'm not going to out them, but was in a band you would recognize that was playing what? out with them. That was pretty Oh, no, funny. you got to out him, dude. Ooh, I'm no, sorry. You have oh, to. I don't know I'm, who I am not, No, no, I'm not. I'm not going. Come to. on. Uh, I will tell Come you. Come on. You type it Type it, type it, type it in somewhere so we can react to it. Nope, I will. Uh, I will have to do it. Uh, uh, I will have to do it later. Maybe while you're playing, it's just Dwarf Fortress. It's just like in that thing you do when they lose their bass player and they have to find a random guy who is like a session musician and he's like <laughs> twenty years older than all of them and it's just like, yeah, no, I can handle your stupid songs. Okay, <laughs> no, he's super, he's super duper nice. Yeah. Um. All right. Uh, we are going to start with some sword ship and then maybe move into some dwarf fortress sword ship. Yeah, maybe. Uh, yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Dwarf fortress. Dwarf fortress does not give a shit about being captured for streaming. Dwarf fortress has eluded no. capture for 25 years. It's not going to start Roughly. now. Sword ship is a game that is available, I think, on almost everything at this point. Um, but I'm going to start and then I'm going to have it explain itself because I kind of dig this game. Quite a Tell bit. me on it because someone in our Discord was very hot on this game. Yes. Does that have like film grain on it? Yes. Hold on. I'm just going to change okay. a quick thing. That's what here. that is. Hold on. It doesn't like being in the background. So give me a, a lot of guesses in the chat. You said bassist, right? Not guitarist. Bassist. I have to double check and I'm going to I'm gonna message my wife when we're switching games to double check so I don't give you okay, the hey. wrong. It's John Paul Jones, isn't it? You nailed it. Getty, Getty Lee, right? Nailed mm -hmm. it. Les Claypool. It's Les Claypool. Les Claypool, Jason Newstead, uh, uh -huh. let's see. Flea. Robert Trujillo. <laughs> I'm just, uh, you I'm know, just, it, ro it just rotates reading. in and out. Bootsy Collins. Kim, uh, Kim Yes. Uh -huh. Are you Kim friends Gordon with Bootsy Collins? Kim? You have to tell me. Kim, is, it, is it Kim Gordon or Kim Deal? Uh, all of the above. Okay. All right. What are we doing here, Vinny? Isn't one of the deals still in jail? I forget. How did that go? <laughs> I don't remember off the top of my head. One of them might be. Okay, so I am I am this ship moving around. Mm -hmm. uh, these enemies are trying to destroy me. I can dive underwater, move left and right. I can build up a special by grabbing these things here. But I'm trying to pick up these pods. Just picked one up. It's a little fast paced, so pardon me if... Um... And you're also trying to basically get these enemies to shoot themselves, right? Yes. Yeah, so I'm going to turn the volume up because I like the music in this game quite a bit. Um, so every time there's a red thing, it's pretty much I'm going to get destroyed by it. Oh, boy. Let's move over here. Let's see if I can get this guy. Oh, I want to pick this up. Please, shit. All right, I did it. You All cleared right. it. Boom, stylish. Yeah. Extremely. Um, I immediately like the vibe of this. Yeah, it... It's fast and it gets pretty hard. Uh, I believe it is. They start throwing more and more things at you. Yeah. So you can, these uh, drop boxes you pick up, you can either <laughs> throw them in for cash, these containers, or you can keep them for extra lives and open them up for power ups. Okay. So um, let's dive for longer. Ooh. That was a cool effect. Oh, this is getting nasty. Still got a <laughs> nasty base. Yeah. It's pretty good. All right, here we go. I got to concentrate because this gets kind of intense. All right. Shit. <laughs> okay. I nope. that thing. All right. So I've got some extra lives. Here we go. Now you are the one who has been sword shipped. Uh-huh. Uh, I'm still working sh workshop uh, on that no, one. No, no, it's okay. 
All right. So this guy drops bombs in pairs. Or, sorry, in triplets. I want to get this thing out of here. Nice. Okay, one shot. One shot, one kill. There we go. Sweet trick. Two shots, how's really. The, but... um, how, how's, the, how's the dead zone on the movement? Um, It's pretty good. Because it, it looks maybe a little stiff, but it's hard to tell just from watching. It, um, it's like a game you really want, like, extremely fine movement control. I haven't gone into... Oh, I'm going to miss this. I haven't gone into any of the... Oh, crap. Any of the options? Oh, gosh. Get in there! Nope. Didn't make nope. it. Didn't make it. Like, can you stop on a dime kind of thing? Well, no, it's more like Dead Zone's more like like how much you need to move the stick before the ship starts moving. Mm -hmm. like, Dead Zone is the like initial part of the stick movement where the ship wouldn't respond. Oh yeah, no, I got you. Like you basically basically want like a low dead zone, high acceleration curve, and something like this. Oh, it's got no, you just Let's went quick, into the gonna, laser. We're gonna quick restart. We're gonna quick restart. Uh, let me see if I can. Uh, what you have here you have acceleration um it's kind of it for the controls yeah that, that's something that might be it. that might be it definitely helps yeah it's got a pretty good feel though my bigger problem is like stopping where i need to stop not the dead zone i live in the dead zone uh -huh. I, i've been in the dead zone stephen since king's dead zone yes i just i just read that book over the How summer is it all right not bad. I remember kind of liking the movie. Much, oh, I didn't know there was a movie. Yeah. Um, much like uh, a lot of his stuff, I think. I would have read that many of his books. Like it kind of starts stronger than it ends. Oh, yeah, boy. that's fair. I kind of feel like The Shining is the only one where the ending really just kind of worked without too much fussing. Said it, said it a thousand times. Oh. This short story where his best stuff. Oh yeah, he doesn't, he doesn't have he time. To, yeah, he doesn't have time to peter out. Like a lot of a lot of his a lot of his good horror ideas are great for about thirty pages. Yeah, turns out. Find myself I get in a zone with this game where uh, I start getting too reckless, like that. Yeah, because you want to be baller, was, man. I want to be baller. There was a dead, dead zone TV show as well. Yes, I've never seen that. Weird. Dead Zone movie. Who was in that? Was that uh, was that Jeremy Irons? Oh, that's right. Cronenberg directed that. No, it was Christopher Walken. What? Wait. Yes, the David Cronenberg directed it. Christopher Walken is Johnny Smith. What? Yeah. Dude. <laughs> also Dude. has Tom Skerritt in it and I, Martin Sheen. I, First of all, I hope that was a very young Christopher Walken. It's 83, so he's fairly young. Okay. I mean, he's in his like mid 30s, probably late late 30s I mean, at that I, point. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I can, I, can, I can tell you reading that book that I did not envision that character as Christopher Walken in the slightest. Sure. Well, David Cronenberg did. Huh. That's why he's a visionary. Ah, get him. Nice. Ooh. Ooh. I mean, Tom Scarrett pretty much born to play a sheriff, right? Oh, yeah. A sheriff or a man of some military esteem. Yeah. Yes. Or the captain of a space freighter. Mm hmm. Yes. Somebody with rank. Mm hmm. One of my absolute favorite all-time Tim and Eric bits is the throwaway bit they do where they are trying to write a jingle for Tom yes. Skerritt. And so then at the end, you see that Tom Skerritt has been sitting on the couch the whole time listening to him going, yeah, I don't think this is going to work. Thanks, guys. <laughs> you didn't do a good job. That's pretty much all I think about when you mention Tom yeah. Skerritt. Look at that. Uh, 
Oh, so how much boy. variety have you seen in like the enemy types up to this point? Um, if I can get past this level, you, mm -hmm. you'll see more. <laughs> okay. It's a big if. That should do it. Oh, I missed that. Okay. All right. There's a little bit of wipeout in this. Yeah. Like, obviously, it's not a racing game, but, like, just something about the ship design and, like, the color schemes and the soundtrack. I have that feeling. That old wipeout feeling. Is it a good feeling? <clears throat> yes. I'm going to continue to bang the homeworld drum oh, here. Oh, what did I even get hit by? The bombs. I had a full EMP, too. I didn't use it. All right. Homeworld remastered good. I never checked that out. People seem to regard it relatively well. I mean, I'm not mm. a super fan of that franchise by any means, but I didn't see a lot of negativity around it. Do they, do they do a good job with that? Anyone who knows? Ooh, uh, I don't know how much I played of Homeworld remastered. Jeez, these guys, these guys. These freaking guys. These guys. Come on now. Seems like with a particular patch, it's great. Says Joe the Ball. Mm. Okay. All right. There's a player's patch. It's for players only. <laughs> mm. Come on, I need another cargo container. Just giving me these guys. Oh gosh, here it mm -hmm. is. Nice. So I could detonate this cargo container if I really wanted to, but I would love to drop it off. Okay. Hello. All right, we're killing it. Don't get cocky, kid. Oh boy. That's my EMP. I could just chill things mm -hmm. out for a second. There we go. Nice. Sword ship. Sword ship. Sword ship. Mm. Your sword, sword, sword ship. ship. All right. I think we get to the next line here. Um, let's dive deeper. Getting that base neck going. Oh, okay. One more line. One more line. One more line on the city line. We Just got to do, do another line. Just got to do one more line. One more pure line of swordship. Speaking of lines, is Ray Liotta's last movie that cocaine bear movie? Oh, no. Is it? I think it might, I think it might be. Oh. I don't, I, don't think, I don't think that's the one he was in production on. When no. He passed. Okay. That was in the Dominican Republic, I think. I mean, maybe that movie's all right. Maybe I don't know. Maybe that movie's all right. I got a real snakes on a plane vibe from it, but hey, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Give me those lines. All right, no, apparently Mr. Tambo says that he has a couple more in the hopper after that. Oh gosh, okay. All right, good. I mean, look, ignoble final films is a storied tradition That's right. in, in cinema. We all know how, how Raul Julia went out. <laughs> It's fine. It's the story. greatest performance of his career. <laughs> That's right. Mm -hmm. Man, you just gotta got always Orson be Wells. moving. Uh huh. Orson Welles is the classic example. See Transformers? Yeah. Yeah. Was that Orson his last role? Three. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, very, very fitting. Orson Welles' last role was as a planet. <laughs> mm hmm. For multiple reasons. They should have let him it's talk like Orson Welles, though, I feel like. He kind of did. It's not as flowery. <laughs> sure, yeah, it's fair. Man, Orson Welles was just a legendary shit talker by the end. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. That guy had beef uh, with everybody, and he'd love to talk about it. Uh...
Like to me, that is the ideal of the old Hollywood guy is person who has a million stories and a million grudges and loves to get drunk and tell you about all of them. Yes. Just like, I don't know. To me, he's like, he's like the last of the larger than life, like classic Hollywood figures. Totally. Like in terms of ego and legend and just everything about him was just so grandiose. Like it, I, I always forget that he did the freaking War of the Worlds stunt because like he did so much mm -hmm. more later that it's like, oh my god, he like, even when he was super young, he was just like setting, you know, making history. Like everything about his career is a guy who was incredibly talented and incredibly creative, and whose later career. It's not that he didn't have any of that, it's that he was constantly disappointed by everything else that cropped up around him. He was yeah. the Citizen Kane of Orson Welles. Yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Just gonna let that one hang. Yeah, let it hang. Here we go, here's this other level, and then uh, maybe we'll switch over to Dwarf Fortress. I think I think I read that he went and he went and knocked all his lines for Transformers out in like one morning. Oh, you're not getting him for more than a day at that point. Absolutely well, not. There, there are some quotes out there from him about exactly how he felt about that role. <laughs> Greatest role of a lifetime. Uh -huh. So here are your different enemies. Oh boy. Uh, ah! game's hard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it looks it. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. All right. Killing it. Nice. Killing it. Always upgrades. I'm not here for the score. All right, we're getting to about as far as I made it. So if there are new newer enemies, I haven't seen them. Got the garbage truck, bombs. Oh, jeez. Nice. Here's my biggest question about Dwarf Fortress. Is there music in Dwarf Fortress now? There is in the title screen. Okay. Amazing. That counts. If it's music, it counts. I was going to say it now. I've never played Dwarf Fortress before. Has anyone really played Dwarf, Dwarf Fortress? So. Does Dwarf Fortress play you? You can play well, we'll too cheerfully out accepted. Shit's happening. Oh yeah, it's all happening. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep. That's what you want. That's uh -huh. what you want. Oh shit. Ah. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah, this is easy. This is fine. Sit here for days. Oh shit. I mean, the go under the water thing, I feel like, is the, the clutch move here. Uh-huh. There's always an out, even when you think there isn't. Oh, man. Nice work. I'm going to have to start dumping some points into lines. Or, uh -huh. sorry, into, <laughs> into, uh -huh. into score. I'm in my groove. No. 
I'm going to be the dad who has one headphone in at my daughter's uh, recital listening to the Game Awards. Mm -hmm. mm. Sorry, the big Game Awards are on. True. <sighs> you know, my opinion is they shouldn't no. give Games Awards. It's just going to encourage people to make more of them. <laughs> Ooh. And no one needs that. Don't encourage them, Alistair. Don't encourage them, Marjorie. <laughs> Jeffrey, Keely, <laughs> Keely. <laughs> Brad, are you ready to go on Dwarf Fortress? Yes. All right. I believe so. Let's let's finish this level out and then let's call okay. it. I do want to make sure we give it enough time. Oh, you oh, telling yeah. me that thing doesn't blow that up? If you're just joining us, this is Sword Ship. Sword. I believe it's twenty dollars. You know what? On everything. Popping it. What are you playing on? I'm playing on PC. Okay. Ah. It's kind of a mess out here. Yep. Nice. Yep. Love to see it. Got a lot of lives. Mm. Bang. Dwarf Fortress music is pretty good. Ooh, can't wait to hear it. Bang, bang, bang. Oh my gosh. Let's give this last life and then we'll switch over. Okay. Our last life for sword ship. You have my sword ship. Oh, this guy's just gonna pop bombs out. You big dum dum. Oh, I got in there. Okay. Let's do it. You ready, Brad? Got in there. All nice. right. Let's do it. That is Swordship, folks. It is 20 bucks. It is on everything. And I think it, I, from what I've seen here, it looks pretty damn cool. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I kind of don't want to exit this game because this was a uh, this was a good run here. But Ooh. a game 500 years in the making. Ooh. Debuting here. For the first time ever on... No one's ever seen right. it. Next Lander. It's been around for 20 years, but nobody's ever played it. Nope. Until the now. only playable build. They said it was only rumored. Brad Shoemaker, what is Dwarf Fortress? Fucking, I have no idea, man. Uh-huh. Got me. No one does. I'm just going to hang out here and listen to this music for the rest of the stream. It's kind of like a little, like, um... Diablo-esque it's going on? Instrument Instrumentation is a little like, the, like Diablo Town music, kind of. Yeah. Stir a while. Listen. Oh, you... Sean Connery? Yes. Sean Connery's Diablo. Stay a while. <laughs> Worship. I think there's like some subtle vocals in there at some point. This is where they spent their budget. Dwarf Watch. Copyright 2002. God, that's so long ago, dude. <laughs> I, I, I hadn't even started at GameSpot. Yes, I, I lived. I still lived in the East Coast. I'm still in college. I was testing was NFL 2K games old. then. 20, 20 year old video game. I don't, I'm afraid to click. Do I'm it. Afraid to click. Create the world. In 2002. I was a motion graphics designer. TM. Back when CD ROMs were a thing. I really don't want to turn this music off. Histories of greed and diligence. And that's what they mm -hmm. say about dwarves. Oh god! Oh god! I'm going back. Oh no! <laughs> back to main menu does not work. No, uh, you, you probably have to do the the click the OK. Oh yeah. oh yeah, I didn't I didn't notice I didn't notice that as a pop up. Um, fraught with many perils. Blah, 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 blah. You will die. Oh boy. 
Hmm. A mountain, a mountain home, home, folks. What is a mountain home? My old mountain home. My own Kentucky mountain home. Saw some people in the chat talking about adventure mode, which apparently is not in this Steam release yet. Okay. Not we have sure to wait another what to make 20 that. years for that. Uh, oh, All right, let's, let's talk, talk about, about this. Pocket World. Maybe yeah. smaller. World. I'm going to keep this kind of on the, vo the smaller side to okay. maximum number of sights. Should I just do everything at low? Nah, I'll keep that mineral yeah. occurrence. And maybe wait for, maybe wait mineral for occurrence. Catch up here. Mineral and occurrence frequent. everywhere. I would say everywhere. What, you want you want what, resources, right? See what people are. What do people demand? Bars? Right. Don't you don't Mr. you want President. minerals? Don't you want the good stuff? I feel yeah, like you just made the medium. game harder for yourself. Well, I'll that's part of the fun, though. Medium. Mm, all right. It's a small world, not exactly a binding commitment. It is a small world, after all. It's a dwarf mm. fortress, after all. The, the plane of hurricanes. Wait, did uh -huh. it, what? Ten what rejected? Ten other worlds? I don't know. I don't know. Well, yeah, 399 50. historical figures. Okay. 2,900 things have happened. Okay. Uh, boy, I don't know. Oh, adventure is coming soon. There you go. It's literally the title. Want? See how long the stream delay is. Probably fortress. What we want. I click fortress. Okay. Man, this music is pretty good, actually. Um, I think you should start with a tutorial. Through a short, yes, okay. Is there a zoom function? <laughs> uh, oh boy. Yes, here we go. Ah oh boy. Is that where I'm boarding? Oh my gosh. All right, okay. you've arrived. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I quote unquote played some of this. I wouldn't say I ever played some of this. And oh, for anyone who doesn't no know, the original version of this game and the version that's been around forever uh, is basically ASCII. Like, you are literally mm -hmm. watching, like, yeah. like letter icons move around on this map like it's the Matrix code. Yeah, it's, it is it is a straight-up text mode game. Like, it's a, like a mud from the 70s or something. Almost. Very rogue. Um, okay. Uh, Strike the Earth. Uh, Stuka's better. Oh, wow. This doesn't even have smooth scrolling. <laughs> Nor should it. Uh, oh. Okay. Huh. Oh, now interesting. Here's a tale of dwarves. It appears to take some time to draw the tiles in when you zoom. Is that what's happening? Oh, you're zooming... Um, depth wise yes I'm zooming I'm zooming at the moment it's, it's like you're no it's like ah. you're I don't think it's trying I think you're zooming levels like a Z depth not uh, in and out like you're that's the levels of the trees oh yeah oh sure wow interesting yeah yeah it's like the uh, oh it's gross it's like the cross hmm. section Underground until you begin mining. Okay. Control mouse wheel. Aha, uh -huh, yes. There Clear, it is. Clearly. Oh, oh, oh Lord. <laughs> I see cats. I see goats. Huh. Since Dwarf Fortress, the your, your chicken has wet toes game? I don't know. I don't know how to answer that. <laughs> I really don't. So what is all of our collective experience with this? I Mine is entirely... Zero. Third-hand stories from people who have played it. Okay. Mine is a lot of stories. I feel like I've played some of it in a loose memory, maybe with Dave Snyder. Maybe he played it. Uh, and I have played that sounds touched, right. a little bit of RimWorld. Okay. How, do I, how do I know who I'm assigning this task to? Or does it even matter? Why not even matter? Okay. Span multiple elevations. 
And again, this is a, a simulation, so part of this Ooh. is just seeing seeing what happens. Oh, look, you built it to oh, go everything's down. Everything's paused, right? Yeah. I see. Oh, things are happening. Yes, that dwarf has built your staircase to heaven. Now what? God, tell me what to do. <laughs> Take a regular hallway or room. Minor requires a pick. Can I, like, see what people have? Oh, no. Oh, I want. Oh, yes. Dave Dave Snyder did, in fact, play it at Giant Bomb at some point. Mm -hmm. I don't think many, I many years like ago. actual people. That's... Uh, what do they want me to do? Regular mining mode. Single. Three by three. How big is a stockpile? Okay. How about that? Four by sure. four. Dear four by five. Four by six. Six by six. Wait. Did that lock in? Oh no! I, I have to know. pick a. Uh, I have to pick a worker, right? Oh, I, did I? I needed to. Did I need to lock in the elevation? That was it. Ah, yes. Think. Dig the earth. Oh, also, did I just? Did I just? Am I going to flood this tunnel as soon as I build it? I hope What's so. going on here? Let's find out. It's kind of what it looks like. Later, you can consider making it. Uh, I think it's just a little water. Yeah, it's a basement. Uh, now, you have, now you have a. Yeah, that's, that's right. If it's not a basement, unless you have water. In it. Oh wait, where was the where was the thing about how to pick a, a worker? Like I don't know how to see who. Oh, oh, you just see that they're holding a pickaxe. I don't think there's an inventory as such. Should I cancel this? Now the water droplet is gone. I don't know what that means. I kind of want to see what happens. Assign a miner. Do I just click a dude? Wait. Chat, how do you... How do, how do, how do I tell it? I, what's happening? Regular mine. It said, I, I, I mean, I made the thing. Do I just unpause it and he'll just do it? Yeah, try unpausing it. I think so. Oh, boy. Let's do that. Instead. Wait, did that... Oh, how do I cancel my first one? I see so, somebody in chat said tool? something about that said I'm like about to learn the aquifer lesson which does not sound like something I want to learn at all. Move mining. I, not do, I wonder if I'm locked into this because this is the tutorial. Let's learn. I bet I can't. Let's learn I bet together. I can't reverse this. Okay. Yep, there he is. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah, mining. Maybe he's look at that. like around here. Maybe you just like leave that last square on. Oh, oh boy! Oh boy! Wet toes. Hey, I'm a, hey, I made an underground lake. What do you think? That's right. It's pretty good. It's an sw underground swimming pool. Hey, you 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 did what the yeah. tutorial wanted. That's all that matters. <laughs> did he just curse? <laughs> I think so. I think I saw him cursing very fast, very quickly. Is there a way to he, slow he down the animation? Bad. I love to make it just go a tad bit slower so <laughs> we can keep track of what's going on. I'm not sure if I'm seeing any such thing. This kind of looks like pause and zoom controls, but I don't see... So anyway. Okay, so you're All not right. giving oh. any orders to individual dwarves. You're just saying, hey, go do this, and they will send someone to go do it. Okay, so I might have to build a new staircase? I'm guessing? I don't oh, know. Hey, look stairs seem to work. Look at all that business. Oh, it's your stop What's pile. A wagon, dense rush... Stray kitten, tame. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's maybe try this again. Can will it even let me make a new staircase? Yes, it will. I'm gonna get like three levels deep. Oh boy, I think I can. Except once again, I don't know how to cancel this. Maybe I should just satisfy whatever they want me to do here, so that it'll open up. Supplies on the wagon are in danger of being turned off. I don't know that my cave is a good place to build a stockpile. <laughs> Probably <laughs> not. Build your new cave. Try it anyway. See what happens. Because, again, this is the tutorial, so you can always start this over if you need to. Uh, I don't know if it's going to let me build another staircase. I think it's kind of... Oh, no, there it goes. 
build two levels down. Oh boy. What do you think of that? Okay. Hell yeah. Whatever whatever makes uh, your heart happy, man. Now can I dig out here? Okay, no water above. Seems safe. Okay. Oh, oh right, I left it running. Easier to dig. They hit a big stone? Hmm. I bet I'm they... just assuming because this is Dwarf Fortress that this dude's pickaxe has like durability, durability. and like he, mm -hmm. he might have he might have hunger and thirst and fatigue and like cellular degeneration and who knows what other factors ticking mm -hmm. away. Can you click on the sparkly stockpile while he's building to satisfy Maybe. your next uh your next Possibly. bit of business? I just I didn't want to put a stockpile in a flooded cave. Oh no, no, no. Uh, no, no one would ever do that. Somewhere safe to place your pile, it says. Mm -hmm. On the surface and underground. Oh, okay. I thought I had to put the stockpile underground. Well, now that we're here. Mm -hmm. Zooming, the zooming and scrolling is a little bit of a mess. Is that stockpile? Yes. Build a stockpile, Thomas. Whoa. That looks like some kind of ore or gem. You've done it. There's a cat in here. The cat's cat? like, nah. <laughs> all right. I built a stockpile. Wait, place all stockpile. Uh, Click any icon that all... says stockpile type. Oh, okay. Hmm. Right. Sure. Okay. Thriving. Oh, it's one of those games, huh? Mm -hmm. Go chop down a bunch of wood, huh? Mine a bunch of stone to build things, huh? Boy, they make too many of these days. Go punch those trees. Indeed. Uh, may want to create a dedicated wood stockpile. Huh. Okay. All right, is that tree felling mode? <laughs> Where's your woods? And I'm not seeing, yeah. Uh, seeing a lot of. Hmm. I guess maybe a singular tree? Is there no just forest? I guess I guess these count as trees. They kinda of look like bushes, but Yeah, shrub. kind of shrub like. Oh. Trees, bushes, it's all the same shit. Oh wait, maybe um Brad if you zoom, tree zoom, zoom, orders? zoom back up because I think you're seeing tree stumps. You see the, the oh. trees the trees. Oh stumps. right, yes. Oh yes, yeah. Yes, right. It's uh huh, boy. Now you're thinking mm. fourth dimensionally. Mmm, yes. Really? Trying to get a sense of where the... Okay, sure. How about this area here? Sure. Wait for the woodcutter to chop down the tree. Mm. <laughs> I think they're moving all their stockpile stuff. Oh boy. Oh bother. Gub gub. Are they? Where are my tree shoppers? Yeah, I think they, are they still moving stockpile stuff? Oh, there's one. Just thinking about it. Maybe. I wonder if you can I wonder if you can lower the number of increments you scroll with a key press, because it kind of mm. scrolls a lot. Getting the sense that maybe you'll like never be the zoomed in ever again. Maybe? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. God, can you imagine playing this in text mode? Uh, two, two, two. Should I make a wood only stockpile, I guess? Let's do that one. I can't see the zone I defined for chopping, can I? Does it maybe not show you, up? Maybe if you click it again? Yeah, maybe. 
I don't think so. I think it was around here somewhere. Ah, ah, ah. Over in this direction. Yeah. Ah, let's just put it there. Uh, now, can I toggle everything off except wood, or is this making it just wood? I think that's this? just wood. Okay. Yeah, okay. You, like, hold shift and do multiple? You can't. All right, so that should just make it a wood stockpile? Sure! I feel like I might we'll need to that. issue that, that tree chopping order again, because it still says chop down tree, and I'm not seeing any chopping. Not seeing any chopping, dwarves. Oh, somebody uh -huh. in the chat saying they can't reach Pick that that uh, level you you designated for chopping. So like, you oh, on, oh, on I, the okay, plane I thought you selected. I see. I thought that I thought that the um, I thought the chop order would apply to all levels. We're That's learning nice. about uh, uh, you know the granularity. The granularity. Okay, mm -hmm. well, how about in this case? You kind of need to, like... I think that's the one up, all right? You want to go one... Yeah. That, no, I know, but you need okay. to look at that. Yeah, but you need to look at that to kind of see how much wood is there. Oh, And, okay. like, where to go. So I kind of want to go like this. Or maybe if you just get the stump in the zone, it'll chop the whole thing. Maybe. I don't know. There it goes. Yeah, maybe chop. the tree will just fall. I chop. assume the tree will fall. Oh, look at the tree's that. Gone. The tree's the gone. tree is just gone. Oh, my God. These are some efficient dwarfs. They know what they're doing. More, more than we do. Mm. Is this actually the game that led to the entire survival craze? Did somebody look at this and just go, I need to make this accessible? And was that somebody that Minecraft? Specific. I don't know. Is there an ask you? No, Minecraft. Yes. Minecraft ripped off Infiniminer. We all know this. Mm -hmm. Um... Okay, workshops in building mode. Workshops. You say carpenter's workshop. Two. Hmm. Now well, let's put it right next to the wood. That makes sense. That's where I'd put it. Uh, wait. Where did that go? Okay. It appears to be happening. It's all happening, mm -hmm. man. Make a bed. Okay. I mean, Make I've got enough dwarves. I probably just sh should be chopping, right? Sure. Definitely going to need. Oh, my God. Chop. There you go. Chop away. Chop Mer all that shit. Meryl. Okay. Hey, they want me to make a bed. All right, sure. Oops. No, don't do that. <laughs> Chop the wood. The wood. Hut. Orders. The manager is... Oh, God. Okay, make bed. Make bed. Does that just go? Make no. bed. Sure. Sounds like that might be the case. Okay. Wait. It's still so. Oh, there he goes. Okay. It's been the fortress. I want to know. I'm sure this is a thing the internet is ready and willing to say, but like, what is the longest going Dwarf Fortress game out there? I don't know. You don't want to ask that question. Like, mm -hmm. These are not questions you want answers to. Probably one from like 2002, right? Like somebody's been protecting the server. Yeah, dig down. Dig deep. Oh, you dug too deep. Too greedily. This bed is going, oh no! I've encountered granite or something. You know it's what stone. you found. Granite uh -oh. or something. Man, I was going to put my bed like four stories underground. Is that it? Can't go there? Okay. How about over here? Yeah, apparently underground is generally where the dwarves like being. Mm -hmm. They all have the sun, like me. It's my understanding. Is that built? 
think it turns gold, mm -hmm. right? When it's, uh... Yeah, you're right. Maybe they're too busy. <laughs> what exactly are they all doing? Yeah, it's still moving yeah. stockpile stuff, sleeping, passing Living. out. Hmm. There it goes. Man, that guy's a workhorse. Yeah. yeah. I think he might be my only pickaxe guy. Oh, uh, gosh. How do you build a room again? Is it just this, right? Large oh, boy. Room. <laughs> that guy's got a lot he'll of work. Done. I don't know his name, but he'll get it done. I still want to know how you like... Oh, what if you... Oh, in the God. lower left, Brad, can you click on that uh, icon there? Citizen information menu. I'm still in the tutorial. Okay. I think let me do other stuff that's bad. Not yet. Okay, beds are found in the furniture category. Okay. Wait. I'm going to say right now, that dwarf looks a little strung out. He's He's been digging. For, seems like he's been doing some lines down here. Months. Does this not show, like, stock? Or is it just because this is more colored in that means I have one? I don't know. Jeez. Wait, was that, was that... Was that not the bed I already have that I just placed? Do I need to, like, go back to the workshop and retrieve it? Where did the bed go that I had? That's my question. Is it... In that workshop? That's kind of furniture thing on me. I don't know, like I went to furniture, like it says, and I clicked bed, but it... Yeah. Kind of seemed like it, I don't have the materials? Someone has just posted a what? link to an infographic from someone's 30,000-year-old Dwarf Fortress world. Great. Okay. Uh, a bed object must be made at the carpenter shop. Yes, I did that. Okay. And then select, select material it. after placement. Something I missed there. Used closest material. Yeah, try and place it. See what happens. Yeah, this Maybe. is where I got to that I'm not clear. Can you just select? Yeah, that bed. Oh, oh. Am I supposed to pick one of these? Hey, maybe that's the the bed. That's the distance. What's the 30? difference? I think that's the category. What is, what is the maybe that's one of them. Ah, uh, okay. Maybe so. That looks like maybe bed installation is commencing. Yes. <laughs> Great. Delivery. Somewhere to sleep. Mm -hmm. Zones menu. Mm hmm. Are we in the cool zone? You have to build the cool zone. Could, could you build a cool zone mm -hmm. for me? The rest of the interface is now enabled. Okay. Information about them. That's, that's, oh, yes, yes. Ooh, is it raining? Oh, no. Everybody's going to get wet. Maybe. Thunder! Oh, here you go. Wait until you get through there. Dacos, Dacos, Ficon. Uh huh. Or Dacost colored glazes to his friends. Mm hmm. Uh, what is the camera icon? Oh, you I think can that's fine him. then? Look at his log. Yeah. He's so annoyed. Uh, where are you looking? Oh, down here. Uh huh. He's annoyed when caught in the rain. Hmm. <laughs> Felt fond Just like us for real. Friend. Huh. He felt euphoric due to inebriation. He was annoyed after sleeping in the grass. <laughs> in there, bro. There's some items. Let's see. Wagon. Stray billy goat. Uh-huh. Green tree frog. Remains. Uh -huh. It's a dead tree. Green tree frog. Okay. It is coated with water. Mm-hmm. Free pause and judge the Okay. Left side of the screen. Yes. Okay. Alert! Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're playing Dwarf Fortress. <laughs> Stop. Plays. <laughs> perhaps they're generous, but yes. You're you're nudging Dwarf Fortress into particular situations. I assume this is like what mining crypto really looks like when it's happening. Mm. Like if uh, mm. 
when your apps when you take it out if your if your computer is mining crypto this is what's happening dwarves are going down and looking for the crypto aha uh -huh. see uh -huh. he canceled oh that must be the one where he ran into a stone trying to dig down damn it doc cost Huh. Started raining. Times three. I've struck fire opal. That's why, man, I should get that. Ooh. Dismiss the large red alert. <laughs> For the coming winter, eh? I heard it's, it's coming. Late spring. It's only the 26th of Felsite. Apparently, you can get isitwet.com right now for $2,000. A bargain by any, mm. any stretch. I, 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 I might buy it. What? I can, I can think of... <laughs> no, I'm not, think I'm of not least, actually going to do that. Think of at least four business ideas around that domain. Mm. Mm -hmm. None of them good. It's probably Please sold code. by now. Ooh. Somebody bought it. And the answer is yes. Mm-hmm. That's an easy way to do it. That's okay. Your infinite amount of boulders. Jewelers workshop. Okay, so I need a trade depot. Should buy do I need a craft specific workshop? You definitely need a jeweler's workshop. Should buy a domain that is just is it supposed to rain today? And all it is is one box for your zip code and then just yes or no. That's uh that's all I need to know on any given day. Yeah, that's fair. Hmm. Alright, looks like they're turning you loose, man. <laughs> you can do whatever you choose. Losing is fun. I've always said this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> if you'd like a goal, try these things. More likely, you're dwarf <laughs> will starve. Hmm. Oh, man. Losing is fun. It's... Uh, wow. Oh, okay. boy. Oh, I've always boy. said this. Go get him, Brad. Uh, now what? Eat that turtle. My bedroom. There's my... Which stockpile is this? Is this the... Is that the Eric stockpile? Those dead mice? That's, that's stockpile number one. What is that? Hamster? A pigtail bag. Uh oh. Got me. What happened they to the pigs? There are flies down there. Okay, hey, that's for digging space. That's for digging stairs. Is there a mine gems? Yet? Does chat know anybody looking at chat? Is that just mining? Uh, I am looking at chat. Is that hauling routes for mine carts? Hmm. I have no traffic areas. Yes, yeah, uh, good call have... on, the, on the pausing. Setting up farms and making a crafting space are usually the next thing to do. You just mine a tiles. Farm. If you mine a tile that contains gems, you'll get the gem. Oh, okay. So it is just the regular that tracks. Hey, okay. you really want to go that. get that shit? Yeah. Hell yeah. I don't need to eat. No. And we need riches. Actually, there's obviously some more right here. Clearly. There you are. <laughs> That's all I do. Yeah. It didn't seem to mind it. Hmm. Oh, shit. Wow, time passes pretty quickly if you don't pause it. Um, we got another uh, tip here from Sir Retris that says that arrow pointing to the right are more options. I, th I assume on the toolbar. Oh, yes, yeah. my old, my favorite old video game podcast, Arrow Pointing to the Right. Mm-hmm. Um, Aha. Uh -huh. It's also an hour pointing to the down. Hmm. 
that one wasn't it's so only good. Gyms. All right, should we make a farm? Free shopping, yeah, uh, make a farm. plants gathering. We should have some people gather some plants. But what you plants, will need those. You ask? How about all? Whoa, did the chop those trees first? Should I make another? Let's see. Oh, wait, there was a stockpile. That's not a stockpile. Is it? How do you start making babies? Mm, Need more They'll figure works. it out. They're going to have to figure that out on their own. It's probably too big for a stockpile. What, did, what are these? These bags. I think that's the farm stuff you just made, isn't it? Mm. Loaded oh, tubers. That was a order. Oh. Aha. Yeah, look at him. Got him go. Is the cat working? The cat's just hanging out. Cat does what cat does. Jeez, they really the cat. gather up, huh? I think, uh, I think cats Brooke should. Is... Sorry, go ahead. Hold their weight more. Yeah. Lasbrook from the chat here says you want to get your food and your workshops going. People like to have their own bedrooms and separate uh, gathering mm. space to hang out and eat. Uh, boy, it's tough to keep track of rooms here. Yeah. How about I make a bunch of beds? Sure. Dormit dwarfatories. Nice. Can I? Can I? It seems like the kind of game where I could just say like make six beds. It does seem like there's the, yeah like that repeat infinite thing? Is that just the, click uh, this to repeat indefinitely? To repeat indefinitely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about that? Oh, that's a lot of beds. I just want you to will specify. Always need more beds. I just want to put in a work order. Uh, I don't see a way to just give it. You just want to hit the IKEA catalog. Priority? I just want to say make like how many? Okay. Applewood bed. How do I find out how much wood it may it needs? I don't want to use all my wood on beds. Actually, I'm not seeing. Oh, my wood is wet. Oh boy. What? Oh. Can I? I don't see a way to see how much wood is in here. Uh. Do I just need to like do this? Yeah. Okay. Fine. There might be a better way to do this, but who knows? How many There's people do be I a have? Better. Seven. Oh wait, some of them already got made. How many do I actually have now? Uh, that's um, that's here, right? Yes. Can I see how many beds I have? Not sure that I can. Must be an inventory thing Whoa. somewhere. Ah, oh, sleeping in that bed. The, the fisher dwarf is sleeping. She's embarrassed after sleeping without a proper room. Oh. I get it. Take what you can get. Okay. So like material after placement. Can I just do use closest? Oh man, it seems like there you should also be able to place multiple beds. It's a hold, maybe like a hold shift thing, or is it doesn't do that? Maybe. I feel like there's a lot of dwarf fortress isms we just don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. I mean, maybe I put enough beds down the whole. Oh, there's a keep building oh. after placement toggle in that uh, when you place the bed. Oh, okay. Oh, I've got one more, I believe. Assuming it's done. Actually, can I clear all that? I thought he would have done that in the first place. Maybe I need to make more pickaxes, probably? Mm -hmm. Nice to have more than one person who can dig. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, you uh, chat saying you need a rock oh. stockpile or a, a rock pile or a stockpile for mm. a full of stone. Okay. I actually have any stone to stockpile yet, but I oh, wait, this... do I have has that been piling up somewhere? Or that might be the stuff maybe they don't have room for it? Maybe that's not why that that's why they're not picking it up. Is that dead Could mouse? Be. Gross. Rotten rat remains. It's a rot rat clams? Or turtles. On turtle shells. Boy. 
Wait, there's a pickaxe just sitting there. Or is that just part of the wagon graphic? Pick up your shit, guys. Come on. Those are these animals are really animals you need to go somewhere else. Um, okay. I keep forgetting where the stockpile stuff is. Need to get a new stockpile. Here we go. Best place for that. Pick up that dead frog. Gross. Wait, did that get confirmed or no? I feel like it didn't. There it goes. Uh, you have to hit accept, right? Yeah, there you go. Um, do, 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 do. stone only. Rock and stone. Mm -hmm. Rock and stone. Oh, there they're it already is. Stone. Now they're, they're bringing it, it out of that rocks. cavern. Oh, okay. So maybe those loose rocks down there were in fact loose and can be picked up and moved. Must have been. I thought I thought they still needed to be mined out. Look at this. A dead frog. Somebody needs to deal with that. Cat, where are you? Dog, somebody eat this dead frog. <laughs> Stray dog has no official position. Mm-hmm. It's the best I way guess. to live. Um, um, uh, the yes. chat really wants you to appoint managers with the crown icon. Uh, I'm not quite there yet. Uh, should allow you to do more detailed and granular stuff that you wanted to do in your workshop. Ooh, a bookkeeper. Mm. Militia commander, you say? Hmm. Sheriff. I feel like getting, getting some chief well, medical dwarf. <laughs> sort of is thing, a really good title. Food going might be a bigger priority, but maybe this would help with that. Although I don't see much here pertaining to food. My nobles. What if I don't? What if I desire a society without nobles? Hmm. Hmm. Like a perfect what if, society. What if, this, what if this is like a no aristocracy zone? That would that would truly be the cool zone. Okay, maybe I should appoint a militia commander. The hierarchy begins. Who's this expedition leader? Ooh. I'm trying to click this person and get details about them, but I, I can't. Uh, planter, stone crafter. No hmm. relevant skills. Sounds like me. <laughs> oh, there's a whole other tab there, maybe? Of other? Can you do other people in the... Oh, oh. the work orders were the... Jeez. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow! Wait. Justice. Holy shit! Can you, really, can you seriously set up your own legal system? Man, this game's fucking nuts. <laughs> oh man. Uh, okay. 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 Uh, what happened to all that, all the plant stuff that we gathered? Where did that go? Killed did I go into a stockpile. Also, a little hard to keep track of your underground stuff. Ah. Uh, uh, yeah, I like the maybe playing like this is like, ooh, underground fish. <laughs> Man, I should go get those. Uh, maybe this is the way to go. Mm. God help me, what am I doing with my life? There's no ah, simple answer. No, to actually, that okay. That actually is a better way to find your stuff. Oh, hello. Zoom did not work out of time. Oh, that's a tiny star. Um, maybe I don't have food anywhere yet. <laughs> I want to know if that uh, the plant stuff we gathered is food or not. Well, it does eat. say you have. Does that mean they have less than forty food? Uh, I think around. About, 40? I think it means about around forty. 40? Yeah. Okay. I'm told it's usually about. The chat was saying I need to get farms going, so I'm just trying to figure out my food pipeline here. I don't think you can like click on that and see where it is or what it is though. Stocks. Oh my god. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I assume that a an umbrella category called food is too much to ask. 
If you have, um, I guess I can scroll this list and see what is represented in here. We've got about 80 body parts. Okay. If you click um, it, does it give you more information on what, what those body parts might be? I would love to know what body parts. Oh, it's oh, mostly contour. Uh, Every okay. item in the fortress. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Numbers will be approximate until we have a bookkeeper and they have an oh. office to work in. <laughs> Alright, we gotta of teach course. one of the math and get them a computer. Man, a lot of this oh, okay. is pond turtle heaven. We have we have roughly eighty pond turtle shells, seventy eight of them, in fact. Uh, drinks we got here a lot of dwarven ale, good. Okay. Good. Fish, cave lobster. It's a lot of cave. Is that much like a crawdad? Where sixty logs. Sure, what this subscript four means. There are your 20 plants. Maybe those are the ones you gather around fish. 20 raw fish. A bunch of remains. Mm -hmm. A bunch of seeds. Okay. I'm sorry, what? Dimple cup, dimple cup spawn? Okay. Um, okay. How about here? How about this? Stockpiles don't take any resources to build, right? No. It's a great I don't question. Think so. Okay, good. Then get to work. I gotta remember to pause to it, it when I'm not doing stuff. I think you gotta click it's accept, it. right? Oh right, yes, I keep forgetting you have to do that. Um hmm. Let's keep it at all for now just to see what shows up in there. That's currently the best way I know to find out what I've got. Mm. Is to just make a stockpile and see what they put in there. Everything. Okay, there's some logs, a barrel. Around 80 seashell or uh, turtle shells. Copper battle axe? What? Oh, I guess this was this all just in my wagon? Oh, I should have done this at the beginning. Are they just dumping the entire wagon in here? I think I think that's what they were trying to do with the downstairs one, but maybe it was too small. I mean, it seems yeah. like you need a big stockpile. Yeah, that's that's why I made a gigantic. Oh, yeah. Is each, call. I should, each thing takes should one shop space? Each. Uh, seems that way. I should have oh chopped these trees first. Okay, let's see if a chop order will stack on a stockpile. Um, just let's hope this they don't chop my stuff. Mm. I don't know. Don't chop my took. stuff, bro. Looks like, it looks like they have little axes on them. Uh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, they totally do. Some of them. Um, I wonder if you have to, do you have to order somebody to pick up a tool or will, like if, if there's you, a free axe, will somebody just grab the axe and start helping? I don't know if there's any direct guess, control over anything. I guess that really goes to the disposition of my people, right? Like, mm -hmm. if one of these is, a, if one of these dwarves is a layabout, then perhaps I can't expect them to chip in. Wow, very judging. Hmm. Yeah, okay, yeah, the wagon's like, uh oh, that's a frowny face. Uh, Back here. Oh, a lot of frowny faces here. Are they all getting wet? They don't like the wet. It's out in the rain, it makes me so grouchy. They don't like being outside, really? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I should probably. Well, I built all those beds. They at least have a place to shelter. Oh, God. They, there are either visitors are showing up <laughs> or babies are being had because I have higher population oh, no. now. And for more beds, I suppose. At least none of them are red-faced, like the really angry. Hmm. Oh, oh, that wow, might be coming. That's, oh. that's some stockpile. Uh, food is holding steady. Mm. Okay. I thought you know, that would have dropped by now. Do you know if... Oh, I guess I asked the chat, too. Do they eat if there's just food, or do, they, do you have to have, like, some kind of commissary or, uh, or like, a cafeteria? Gathering area. Yeah. Or a, a table why I was or benches. To... Yeah, that's why I was trying to see what kind of food I had. Try to figure out if there's something I need to do with it. But uh, chat says they'll eat when they're hungry. Great. Okay. Self-sufficient to work. Much like, much like me. Mm -hmm. um, can I build a trade depot yet? Because they said that'll be in autumn, and it's almost autumn. All trading will be done. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Uh-oh. 
Who's sorry, the Ming Pig Ming Plunges Pig is now plunges. the king of the Razor of Artifice. I'm sorry uh -huh. I gave you the right. <laughs> okay, now I'm just uh, thinking of Ming the Wrestler, and that's really funny. What the fuck is going on in this game? I ask. Is Meng, Meng uh, part of your... There is. King. Listed as a king. No job, sure just enough. king. The Tongan Terror. Uh, his, his lever is Eton Bridge Rain, apparently. I must pray to Zekrum. It's frustrating. It's frustrated after being unable to pray to Zekrum. <laughs> Unmet need. Pray to Zekrum. Is that, is that a euphemism? I don't know, <laughs> man. Yeah, it's got a... The king needs a royal throne room. Uh huh. That's right. Yeah, so Zekrim, I'll be in my spot. I gotta pray to Zekrim for a while. Uh -huh, don't bother me, Mom. Oh. I was praying to Zekrim. Uh huh. Yes. Uh. All right. Where was I? Oh, trade depot. Right. It's trade depot. And the, one of the things I'm not clear on is how to see material costs. Oh crap, I will need a three wide path to the depot. Oh crap. This is a lot to take in. I really just want to know how much a building costs. Select material after placement, maybe that's the way to go. I mean, this seems like it can just go here. It's pretty clear over here. Hang on. Let me learn from past experience and first shop. Chop and clear. Yeah, I mean, I guess this wood. Oh, well, we still got room over here. I guess this wood will just go in the stockpile when clear. You want to grab all the uh, the forage from there too? Yeah, I should probably do that. Um, How's this? Probably gonna take a while. Oh, I need to unpause. That would help. Yeah. Everybody! Yeah, look at that. Get it done. Hop two, dwarves. Mm-hmm. Okay. Where are these patches? I think that's where they so forage. Where they yank out the yank out the plants. Oh, your storage must think they must be full because they're leaving wood behind. Yeah. Oh, oh no, this plant. I can be. There. I can be addressed. Shall build the largest stockpile the world has ever seen. Oh boy! <laughs> Somehow, I, I feel like you're right, but also somebody's immediately going to post a picture of some other stockpile that's like an entire continent. Oh sure, I believe it. Yeah. Also, I, I should probably be doing more downward digging and <laughs> the stuff underground. But for the sake of expediency, we don't have a ton of time left. Mm -hmm. Just want to see things happen. Uh huh. Uh, I love seeing right, is this roughly roughly where I was okay this is starting to look clear-ish okay so if I do select material after placement will that then show me what it is actually required to build oh wow okay uh huh there's no just confirm is there oh my god do you actually have to wait what did I just do I think they're just going. Looks like they're doing it. But, yeah, but was that not all required for that? Was it like pick one? I picked like plum logs or something, and that was it. Yeah, plum wood logs. I thought that I was going to have to like confirm all of those materials. Oh, oh, oh. Like which wood did you make it from? Oh, oh it is. It literally is a choice, says chat. I guess you can pick different materials to make stuff. That's very different than like every other crafting game on the planet. I wonder if that, I mean, I shouldn't have to ask. Anytime I start to ask, like, hey, is there more nuance or depth to thing? Mm -hmm. The answer is probably yes. I started to say, I assume material choice has implications for, like, sturdiness and durability and capability and stuff, probably. So I wonder, I'm not going to actually make another tree, trade depot, but, like, if I were to place another one, like... So it says well, maybe these are actually all the same. 
It says the amount needed three, so you guess you're just picking whichever one you have the most of or want to go. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's the same building no matter what you use. Maybe it's just like, hey, some, some logs are higher value than others, and so you need fewer. Um, chat it, seems to say affects. it's more for items than for buildings. Okay. Interesting. All right, well, I think there's a, a, depot, no? a quality to the, like, the constructed item. Oh, there is. Okay, so... I think it might be what those little like um, glyphs are next to the name, like this asterisks or underscores. Mm. Man, that's a big storage depot. So you guys find somewhere to put your stuff. That's all I have to say. Um, so I matters. guess this doesn't come into play until the traveling salesman shows up. And yeah, they're merchants trading right now. Okay. Can I build farms? How do we get food going? Wall smoothing. Mm -hmm. uh, structures are there. Workshops, sure. I don't know that farms are in here necessarily. That's zones. Probably more Zoom. social stuff. I feel like I've heard this exact swamp bubbling backing track in a bunch of things. Bubbly bog underscore zero zero three. Mm-hmm. What, what are these? Dot wave. Hold tip doesn't actually say what these do. Hold left, choose corner. The corners are right. Huh. Is that for expanding? Oh, are these these are options on the gather order? Is that what's going on here? Yes, okay. I think that's what that is. Oh, God. It's an autosave. Oh, man. Does that save take forever if you have got giant multi-generational <laughs> maps? Oh, yeah, I bet. I could imagine that would be a significant process. Um, it's early autumn. Still no trader. Has anybody said anything about farms? Uh, so I wonder if... Is a farm something that emerges work, organically, not a structure station. that you build? Farm is workstation to farm plot. It is a workstation, a workshop. Oh, it is weird. Okay, I was taking I was taking workshop a little too literally. Um, yeah, okay, let's build one. I started to start digging because I'm now I'm getting antsy about all this mess. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking like, oh, that should go underground, but it's you know, a little late for that now. It's farming for this is man. Magma Forge. Oh, good lord. Oh, bo oh boy. Furman Catcher's Shop. Oh, boy. Finally, these cats to work. Farm plots. Uh, okay. Oh, boy. We got some space here, kind of. It's kind of a farm. It's good farming. I man. wonder if I make this farm now and then tell them to gather all this crap. I wonder if it'll fill in the gaps, I would hope. I said something about no mud. I don't know what it said. It said something. No, I didn't see that. Razgris 2 suggesting uh, you might want to build a still soon. Hmm. Still? Am I running out of ale? Because that's a problem. They, they need their drinks. Mm-hmm. I get it. Mommy Dwarfy need her drinky. <laughs> oh, no. Wait. Wait, the Razor of Artifice is a like a remote kingdom? Why is why why does the king is this <laughs> I'm very confused. Is this the king in exile that I have here? Okay. Are they here? Here? Better get a here drink there. They're everywhere. Oh. Do I need to assign a broker before I can do so? I have really got to pause more. Uh, da, 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 da. Administrators. Broker. Oh. Okay. Um, Judge of wow. intelligence. Adequate negotiator and adequate persuader, huh? Novice liar. Sounds pretty good. Novice intimidator. Novice comedian. 
This is my trader, right? Can the trader also be the broker? Or do I need separate? <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> this guy is just listed as my monarch now. Uh-huh. Uh. Love it. Meng. We'll see about that. Uh. Okay, I have a broker. Broker can access depot. Trader needed a depot. Move goods to from depot. Wait, where are the traders? Does that have any suggestions about how to access them? Let's see. I'll wait for it to catch. Check the icons on the left. Oh, right. Um, I should be using these more. Hmm. <laughs> Apparently one of my Applewood beds is a masterpiece. Uh, they will be here soon. It will pop up on your screen. Oh, I thought it said something about the trader is a welcome site or something. Migrants have arrived. Um, move good. Uh, they'll come in time. It says Omega Rock. Omega no Rock. I'm going to go with that. They come in time. Move goods to the area as it takes time. Yeah, it says merchants have arrived and are unloading their goods, but anyway. Because clearly I have so much of value to trade. So yeah. you have, I guess you have to move stuff to your trading area? You have all those turtle shells. <laughs> they are not picking up these plants. Or do I need to chop those? Or are those... Sure, those look more like weeds than crops to me, but... Weed is a crop. Uh, are they planting here also? Oh, there they come. Oh. Are those the guys? Oh, looks like a trader. Oh. oh, boy. Things are happening. Oh, what in the world? Kill them. Lock them in ah, there. Dig underneath uh, them. Steal their goods. <laughs> what? Get them. Can I build them? Diplomacy? Can I build a moat around this trade depot? And yes. Just catch? Just kind of... Hmm. Dig out one around One way them. in, one way out. Uh, let's let's discuss my situation. Okay. Information added to civilization slash world info. Oh my god. Oh boy. Holy shit. Oh boy. My goodness gracious. Oh man. Trade like, them the king. Okay, we're we're gonna have to assess our needs a year in advance. Apparently. We okay. you know, you think you, do we think we're gonna need bug bat leather? I think Mulmerian leather is the better one so anything mm. you can drink and that's really just in the one leather category Good oh, God. okay God. hang on cave blob leather <laughs> uh hey man don't knock hmm. it until you try it how do you make leather uh, out of a blob it's naturally gelatinous cave wheat can I grow wheat in a cave can rock here. nuts yeah rock nuts um I don't know what I don't have. I know I've got a bunch of dimple cups spawn. I saw it in the manifest. Dude, how in the world are you supposed to answer these questions? I barely know how to build stuff in this game. I guess I could just randomly pick some stuff. How about drinks? Okay, sure. Now you're speaking my language. Oh, how is this not Where? in alphabetical order? There it is. I have had some amount of dwarven ale already. Horse make rum? I'm just gonna take some of everything that I don't already have. Yikes! Whoa! Oh, hey, some markup. man. Also, apparently that was binding because I don't see an option to change it unless I can click in here and. Yeah, no, I think that's it. They have to die. Huh. Okay, well, we only put in for booze, so <laughs> clearly going going gangbusters here in this colony. Um, hmm. Okay. How do you build? How do you build your still? Your moonshine. I don't know. I do. I feel like there's something, some, something. Oh boy! Something else I need to do to activate this farm. I think I have seeds, but oh, I thought I saw that I did. 
Do you need to I give somebody a farmer job? Where's the master list of um, um Chat of says click, click the farm. I don't know if that does oh, duh. anything. Okay. Oh yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. uh, Thank you. Uh, there's farm. a problem. Somebody left this farm set to leave fallow. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Uh, okay, well, I can make bilberry bushes and blackberry and... Oh, come on. Can I not do multiple? Huh. I like raspberries, sure. Delicious. Kind of miss planting season, I'm afraid, but... It is what it is. Hmm... Uh, what else should we do? Still. Okay. That's that's not a structure, I assume, or maybe it is. I think everything's like in these, right? I'll Screw press. Machines slash fluids. Water wheel. Holy bully. Mm. Constructions. Oh, these are just. These are just like machine parts. <laughs> are you designing your own machines in this game? I can't. I, don't, I just can't, man. <laughs> it's, just, <laughs> it's too much. It's too much. This is too much. Uh, instructions? Oh? No, I'm not seeing it there. Really not seeing anything that would have still in it, unless it's furniture. <laughs> Or a workshop. Uh, maybe nope. it's like a subcategory of something. Because last time it like. Oh yeah, some of these. Yes, yes, right. Some of these are actually things you can drill down into, right? Workshop and which one far farming. Farming apparently. Oh. Oh yeah. Man, that's a lot. Thank you, chat. Done. Let's make this thing out of chestnut. Why not? I'm just going to give the 10-minute uh, warning here since you need to get out of here soon, Vinny. Okay. Everything you needed to know hmm. about Dwarf Fortress in an hour right. and 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. It's the Internet's most comprehensive guide to Dwarf Fortress. Wow, look at those guards in there. You could take them. I know. Yeah, I was looking at those guys. Fuck those dudes up. I'm telling you, just dig as Martin. far deep around as you can around the your trade depot. And they live Mark's there. Dwarf. Now. Proficient armor user. Disdains tranquility. Mm. I respect that. Alright. Brew drink from plant. What drink? I get to pick. Extract from plants? Sure. Let's see what happens. It is a little hard to keep up with what's going on. It's like, what is the product of this going to be, right? A little Where bit. is that going to go? Like, they'll make something, presumably, but what's the easiest way to, like, I mean, I, there are these, I guess. I should be paying more attention to this stuff. Ooh. Yay. I have a yak calf on my hands. Yak calf. Always wanted a yak calf. Mm hmm. Oh, wait. You got wait, a yak calf. Oh, come back. Let me see. I didn't mean to click through that diplomacy stuff. Now it's gone. Oh, everybody's gonna be mad. They're gonna get wet again. I'm seeing a lot of planting. Oh, how to seeds. Oh, weird. I've got more options to plant now, so now. Do we assume that all of these buildings have no roofs, or does like a trade outpost have a roof? I feel like this is more know. of a we're just showing you the stuff without the roof so you can see it. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like oh, it was. I don't think there's a roof. roof. Yeah. There does not appear to be a roof. Uh, good to know. Well, hey, there's one way, easy way to answer that. Is this person wet? <laughs> yep. Yes. Dot com. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ejected when caught in the rain. I get it. Man, all my stuff's just getting soaked. Uh, okay. Yes, yeah, multiple people in the chat saying the ground is usually your roof. I have. I, oh, sure. Were I to start over, I think my first change would be to build everything underground and just come up for resources. Too late now, though. I wonder, is this my entire landmass? Can I explore beyond these borders, or is this the whole world? 
think it might be the whole world, actually. Oh, the whole wide. I wonder what this is doing on Steam. I bet it's doing just fine. You know, yeah, I hope so. I, there was a uh, there was a thread people were sharing yesterday of like someone incredulously on the Steam forums being like, "I can't believe there are all these positive reviews already. Are you serious? Are all you people like been playing this game for free for twenty five years and now you're buying it on Steam? And it is just reply after reply after reply of yes, yes, <laughs> yes, 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 mm -hmm. because people have hella been doing that." Oh, I believe it. I mean, this is the first time this graphics version, graphical version has come out, right? Like, this wasn't available anywhere before Steam, right? They, I mean, people have had mods for it that um, I think have added graphics yeah, I've, in, but I don't think it's fresh. Right, but I mean, this specific version with this music and all that. Yeah, I don't think so. I, assume, I, think, is, is, I think this is just a couple days old. Um, I'm trying to see if there's a way to adjust the scrolling a little bit. Right with scaling... With. I just like mm. seeing a labor of love like this received this way when it finally achieves a Wait. What, let's call it a released state. Wait, so was my frame rate really capped at one of fifty? Not that it really matters. Anyway. What would you do with all those extra frames, honestly? What do they do here? <laughs> Um, okay. It's number like two on minutes. the Steam sales chart right now. Wow. Damn, good for them. That rules. Okay, can I start a fire? We have three minutes. Can I burn everything down? Oh, it's do do raining. It? Yeah, true. Good point. Apparently, the Steam Deck is the number one seller, so technically, this is like the number one selling game. Holy shit. They sold 160,000 copies yesterday, apparently. Oh, good for them. Because, uh, I mean, this game's mostly been free, right? Like, I, I assume there may have been some ways to give them money, but, like, this has been a free game for 20 years, correct? Yeah, this has. Like, if, if the Dwarf Fortress guy makes a boatload of money by finally selling the game on Steam, it's kind of amazing. Um, thing of beauty. Oh, dig too deep, everybody is saying. Dig too deep. You right. dug too deep. All right. You asked for it. I'm just scrolling. I'm, well, that, is that too much? I scrolled the mouse all the way down. Okay. Wait, it's still going. <laughs> it's still going. I, I mean, you, right? deep. you might be able to dig too deep. I'm scrolling. I went into the negative. What does that mean? What if you, if, if you go into negative elevation? Have I passed the planet's core? <laughs> Is that, and now I'm coming out the other side? Is that what's going on? I think so. Uh, also, it seems like just building down doesn't exactly reveal anything else. Ooh, I almost dug through my own room. In in the ground, right? Like, you have to mm -hmm. stop at a level and then dig out to actually see if there's anything there. Is that correct? Oh, God, I, I my stuff. Also, can I punch in an elevation? A lot faster than scrolling the mouse so much. I have uh, I have asked the image AI robots to show us what your dwarves would look like, Brad, and this is what uh, this Great. is what we got. Okay. Oh, good. Yes, that's an sad, sad, wet dwarves. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna dig. I'm gonna dig. Worst kinds of dwarves. I'm gonna dig down to elevation zero. Let's just see what happens. So sad. I used to be king. <laughs> Somebody get over here and dig. That was kind of like uh, Robbie Coltrane. I did dig near <laughs> water a bit. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> the, the guy in the this the guy in the lower left kind of looks like Davos a little bit. Yeah, like from uh, Game of Thrones. Yes, Why is dig. nobody digging? Why is nobody digging? Will none among you dig? Nope. Oh, sorry. We had a little bit more time. We got like five minutes left. I uh, need to dig stairs. Oh, right. I totally forgot about that step. Can I just do that? Like, oh, 
Can I just cancel out of this entirely? I forgot how you do that. The eraser? Do you need the eraser tool? Yeah, maybe so. Oh god, I don't have to erase like all however many levels, do I? Oh good lord. Oh no. Oh, I do. Uh oh, the scrolling is just and zooming is a lot. Um I forgot I forgot I have to do stairs first. So it's just stairs first, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, there's that other one. I just, I guess I didn't erase it all the way. Apparently, you <laughs> just over, overwrite, but uh, just dig. Just ah. keep going. There we go. All the way down. Oh, look at him go. Uh-huh. Oh, no, he hit stone. Oh, and, and, and stuff. There's a fire opal, it looks like. Still going. They're almost there. Well, they made it. Well, now. Now begins my subterranean kingdom. Yes, this is so. This is where the. This mm -hmm. is where your population split, right? The, the group that went uh. underground, the group that stayed above the surface. Now, fast forward 8,000 years. Oh, oh geez, Brad. <laughs> this guy's got a lot to do. Oh, right. I should probably make more pickaxes. I think we still have one, right? Sounds about right. Uh, where would you make a pickaxe? Also, like a fast, like a shortcut back to ground level would be useful. Oh, I bet that must exist somewhere, like equal Let's key or something. Maybe, yeah. Uh, um... Sort of like a tool making shop. What would that be? Not a metal smith, right? I mean, not crafts. Almost everybody in the chat typed F1. So I'm going to assume that huh. it would be our shortcut. Good to know. Yep, sure enough. Thanks, chat. Hello, in here. Oh, goodness, what? yes. I wonder what happens if I ask the AI bot to give me a picture of a dwarf playing Dwarf Fortress? Oh, what? You can set up macros? That's how you want to spend your tokens, you huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Love it. How about a wet dwarf? Um, chat, where do I make pickaxes? Instructions, workshops. Seems like it should be workshops. Bruises? Smelter? Delta. Whoever smelted Delta. Forge. Delter. Forge. Mm -hmm. And forge, I'm told. Where is the forge? One of my favorite X-Men. Magma Forge? Is that the type of forge I need? <laughs> Are there other forges? Metal you need smith? I'm getting smelt a lot. Smelt ore to make metal, then you need workshops to make them. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of conflicting answers here. Metalsmith? I don't even think I have any raw materials yet that would... Oh, I don't even have any iron anvils, do I? Oh! Is this just nested? Can I just, like, tell it to... God damn, man. I think I told it to make a... Oh, this guy's got a rainbow now. What's that about? I feel like well, every child? question just leads to more questions. <laughs> yeah. bearded, there's a bearded child. Uh, yeah, they're dwarves. They grow, yeah, they grow, they grow those beards pretty young. Of course. Uh, I assume I didn't do it, but I assume you could shortcut a specific depth. Oh, uh, there seem to be a lot of macros. The chat was saying for. Oh my gosh. And people. I have got to get some more pickaxes going. Oh god, there's 19 dwarves here now. I sure don't have anywhere near 19 beds. Hmm. I'm sorry, what? Needs unrotten extract bearing plant plants. Uh huh. <laughs> Naturally. What do you think, Brad, of Dwarf Fortress? Is it everything you expected? Um. Ooh, I struck fortification agate. Where's that? I guess I don't uh, actually know what you were expecting. 
Yeah, I don't I don't know how to qualify my expectations, so I'm not mm. sure I can answer that question. It is um hmm. it's certainly living up to its reputation. As like dense? That? Yes. I'm I'm really curious how much like social stuff there is in here. I mean the fact that there is a justice system justice. Kind of answers that question already. There's considering there's like a social rank and nobility and a legal system and stuff like that. <laughs> uh, I, it seems like this game just goes and goes. Well, Tune in next week when maybe maybe this cavern will actually be <laughs> Oh, God. Just let it run in the background. Uh, I've got to get mm-hmm. out of here. I've got to go um, see my daughter go perform. Yes, can, I, can, I, can, I, can I containerize this game? Yep, just keep it going. Run it on a, run, run it on a server somewhere. Never stop. Uh, there, thanks. Oh, can I can I, insta- can I install Dwarf Fortress OS? This is this is how computers work. This is the background. Uh, there's a high risk here. Thanks everybody for joining us. We'll be back tomorrow with another stream. We'll be doing some dark pictures. The devil inside mm-hmm. with Abby Russell. You can check out the Planorama is up. The Ramblecast is up. The podcast is up. And we'll have a never been a better podcast going up tomorrow with Abby and Jeff Bacalar joining us. Uh, Check out the Patreon. Thanks for supporting us. Patreon.com slash Nextlander. Um, Thanks, Brad, for playing Dwarf Fortress. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Alex. Here are those. Thank you. Here are those dwarves playing Dwarf Fortress as promised. Uh, Thanks to everyone for tuning in. And we'll be back tomorrow. See ya.